Rep. George Santos, Republican New York, is still trying to deal with the fallout after being exposed to have lied about his entire identity. In a Fox 27 News interview, he brushed off his fraud by calling it nothing more than a mistake that flawed humans make all the time. The reality is that I remain committed to doing everything I set forward in my campaign. I'm not a fraud. I'm not a fake, he said. When asked if he has no shame about blatant lies, he explained that Democrats are somehow just as bad, attacking President Joe Biden, but never fully explained how Democrats have invented an entirely different person. Speaking to The Guardian, Long Island resident Mary Lou Albertini called her new congressman a crumb. It's really like he's saying it's okay to do it. Which is really wrong, she explained. She noted that she thinks politicians are mostly crooks, but that Santos took things to a whole new level. I heard him say basically, why should that matter, because other politicians lie, Albertini said. Well, this isn't about them. It's about you, stupid. They aren't white lies about a 4.0 GPA or being a top athlete in high school. Santos lied about his education, his experience, his jobs, indeed his entire resume, his business, his charity, employees, his finances, where he lived, his marriage, his family and even September 11th. Santos claimed that his mother was in the South Tower of the World Trade Center on September 11, 2001, and that she died a few years later. There's no evidence of that, and she died in 2016. The question remains about what Santos didn't lie. Anybody can expect that, maybe he misspoke or something. But if you lie about 100% of everything, people cannot expect that, said convenience store owner Gary Dinsa. People are betrayed, Dinsa said. They are feeling betrayed because he told complete lies. He manipulated everything. Not one or two things. Everything.